Good morning, dear students. Welcome to our YouTube channel, Academia Ambala. So, in today's session, we are going to do the activity of lesson number 7, the word processor, which is given on page number 66. So, the activity is to be carried out in four steps. The very first step is to start MS Word. Second step is to type the text as shown in the picture. Third step is to save the file as my first document on the desktop. And the fourth step is to close the file and exit Word. So, to do this activity, First, we will open the Microsoft Word. So, how to open Microsoft Word? You have to click on the Start button. All programs, there, scroll bit down and you can see Microsoft Office. And various options are there in Microsoft Office, but we have to select the Microsoft Word 2010. Just click on it and once you click it, the Microsoft Word window will be opened. So, let's type the text given in your book. Now, after typing this, the heading is computer. Computer is an electronic machine which takes input and gives output after processing. This is my first file created in Microsoft. Word. Now, after typing the text, so we have completed the second step. We have typed the text. Now, the third step is to save the file on the desktop. For this, what we have to do is, we have to click on the tab File and then click on the very first option, Save. When you click on Save, first you will give the name of the file as my first document. Now, I want to save my file on the desktop. Okay. So, what I will do is, I will choose the location. The students on the left hand side, you can see various options. From there, you have to select desktop. Once you select desktop, this is the current location where your file will be saved. And after selecting the location, just click on the save button. So now, my document is saved on the desktop. Now the fourth step is to close the word and exit it. So how we will close this window? On the top right corner, you can see the cross button. Just click on the close button. Now my word window is closed. Now, on the desktop, I have saved the file. You can see here, I have saved my file with the name, my first document. Let's see what's there in it. I have to open it, I will double click it. Now, you can see, this is the file which you have created in MS Word and saved on the desktop. So, dear students, in this way, you can create document in Microsoft Word and you can store it in any location. Thank you so much.